Say that again. I think it's pretty good. As a seasoned welder, I've never seen better. <laughs>Right. So, um, before I hit the record button on this, we were talking a little bit about, um, uh, you accused Rob and I, um, um, of being millennials, which by the way, I'm still a little offended by that. But, um, so just kidding. I'm not, but, um, how old is the individual that you have working on a cell that's not wanting to take breaks? He's 21. 21. Okay. So for all you old fogies out there that are watching this video, uh, that run companies and are like, these 21 year olds don't want to work here. We have somebody that's 21 years old on the system, not taking breaks, wanting to use it. Um, and then you said he has no, no welding background. Now we got to make sure we make quality weld. So is he getting support from, from, um, somebody that is knowledgeable in welding and making sure that the quality of parts is good. Yes. Yes. They come check it out and stuff, but this program here kind of, he, he lined it up with Matt and, and spent, you know, working with this program that has kind of been set up. But even when he was playing, he was looking at stuff and saying, Oh, this isn't as, um, I, I need to get it hotter because it's not as hot as it needs to be. And, um, we, we are going to end up sending him to some sort of schooling um, because mm -hmm. I'd like him to actually look at if we have stuff that can't be on the robot welder. I think he would do a very good job of welding in general. So we will be sending him to school just to speed up the process some and, and get his mind to think.